Hey, what's up guys? It's Franchise923, and in this video, I just wanted to draw your attention to a new playlist that I just created. So if you're currently at video 24 of the ArcGIS Pro Scripting with Python and ArcPy playlist, I basically used ArcPy in another one of my playlists, and I thought you guys might be interested if you want some, some real-world use cases of ArcPy and how we can, how we can use ArcPy to do stuff. Um, so it's this Garmin API. So I recently got a used Garmin watch um, just because I was interested in playing around with their their data. Um, and they actually, if you plug in the Garmin watch to your computer, they have these fit files for every activity that you do. And you can convert that to a CSV. And then the CSV has um, like latitude and longitude in it. And in this playlist so far, I've basically extracted the uh, coordinates and then made a shapefile with ArcPy. Um, so I know we did that at the end in video 23 and 24, but we were kind of just using like dummy data. Um, but yeah, in here, we're actually, this is a real world use case of ArcPy and it's a little bit more involved. Um, so I, I thought you guys might just want to be interested in, in checking that out. Um, yeah, I never know exactly how to perfectly uh, make these playlists because I didn't want to include Garmin stuff in this playlist, but I wanted to use ArcPy um, So I, I that's the point of this video is just to draw your attention here and, and check it out. So um, I actually put these fit files and CSV files on my github so you can actually follow right along with the same data that I'm using um, It's in the Garmin API folder here. So these are the files I'm talking about uh, this CSV, this is basically what we're working with. We, um, you can see we have position lat and long, and it's actually in this weird semicircles instead of decimal degrees. So in the script, we convert it to decimal degrees and then um, convert it to a shape or create a shape file with ArcPy. So that is it. That was the point of this video. Um, yeah, just check this out if you want. I'm also going to include um, how we can do this with not only ArcPy, but also QGIS and some other open source libraries. But yeah, that's it. And thanks for watching.